Hi, my name is Dr. Emma. I'm a dermatology doctor working in London and I'm also the co-founder of the House of Medics. So hopefully you've been keeping up with us in our suturing series. In the first episode, I showed you everything you get in the House of Medics suture practicing kit and I talked you through all the different instruments that you need to know how to suture. In the second video, I showed you how to tie a simple interrupted suture. And in the third video, I showed you how to do a running suture. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to do a figure of eight. Some of you may know that as a dermatologist, a lot of the skin surgery we do are biopsies. So this is where you take a small sample of skin to um, investigate an undiagnosed rash or maybe a lesion you think might be a skin cancer. And when you take a punch biopsy, you're often left with a circular shaped hole. And that's usually because you use an instrument that's like a hole punch to literally punch out a circular area of skin. So what that leaves you with is this hole that is pretty much circular. This one is of course a bit more oval shaped. A really useful suture to know how to tie to close those types of wound is a figure of eight suture and it's super simple so I'm going to show you how to do it. So of course I'm starting with my needle positioned in the right place on my needle holder and I'm going to put my forceps in my left hand. I've got my wound here and I'm going to start the same way we always start. You um, advance the needle about a few millimeters away from the edge of the wound, go in, and advance the other side. Advance my needle until it comes all the way out. And again, I'm just gonna leave a few centimeters of suture on the other side. And then I need to reposition my needle. And then I'm gonna go back in on the opposite side to where the suture is at the moment. So it's the same side as where I started. So just go in here again, a few millimeters away from the edge of the wound, advance my needle until it comes out the other side. And then advance, advance, advance. And pull the sutra, pull, pull, pull. So now you can already see the wound has come together quite nicely. And you've got this sort of diagonal suture going across the wound. And now what I'm gonna do is tie the long suture to the short suture, suture again in the opposite direction. So it's like the, you've got two diagonals basically crossing over in the middle. So the tie is exactly the same. We're gonna do an instrument tie. Wrap the suture around the needle holder twice. Grab the short end of the suture. Pull whilst crossing my hands over. And then again, around the other way. Grab the suture. And pull. And then once more in the opposite direction, wrap around once. Grab the suture and pull whilst crossing my hands over. And as you can see, this has left you with a nice cross, what we call a figure of eight suture. So I can go ahead and cut off the excess suture. And there you have it, super simple. That's a figure of eight suture. Like I said, these are quite helpful for small, more rounded type wounds that you wanna just bring together really quickly. You know, it's a super, super quick suture to tie. So I hope you've um, kept up with that and I hope you've learned how to do it. As always, if you are interested in getting one of these House of Medics practice suture kits, the link is in the description box. Grab one, let's learn how to suture together.